Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to hopefully resolve if the HP Connection Manager experienced a fatal error. And it says a fatal error occurred. Check the HP Connection Manager in Event Viewer for more details. Object reference not set to an instance of an object. So this should hopefully be a pretty straightforward process here, guys. And without further ado, let's go ahead and jump right into it. First thing I recommend doing would be to open up the search menu, type in Windows Features. Best match or come back with Turn Windows Features On or Off. Go ahead and open that up. Make sure .NET Framework 3.5 is selected or it's filled in here. And if you expand the little plus sign next to it, make sure that is fully checked. So you want to go ahead and check that and then anything under here. And then once you've done that, select OK and give this a moment. Once that's finished, go ahead and close out of here. And now you want to go and open up the search menu, type in control panel. Best result, you come back with control panel. Go ahead and open that up. Say your view by to category view, and then select under new programs where it says uninstall program. Now you want to locate something in here that says HP Connection Manager. If you see one in here, you would just select it and then select the uninstall button. If you don't see it, that's fine. We're going to be installing it. So if you had it in here, go ahead and uninstall it. And then once you've had it uninstalled, open up a web browser of your choice. And I'm going to have a link in the description of the video here to an HP driver download. This is hosted on HP's website. You can see it in the link in the description of my video. This is an HP domain directly from them. And it is a verified publisher, HP Inc. Select yes. Let's go ahead and run that file. You can close out of the web browser at this time. So I'm in a virtual environment, and I'm also not on an HP computer. So that's probably why it is not supported here. But in your case, it should be supported. It shouldn't be a problem. You go ahead and select Finish, and then you would want to restart your computer at this time. And there you go, guys. Hopefully this point or issue should have been resolved. And as always, thank you for watching. I do hope I was able to help you out. And I do look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial. Goodbye.